Hello everyone. This young man you are seeing right here is Mr. Ushena Naj. According to the story, he died about two days ago. This incident happened in FCT Abuja in Nigeria. According to the story by the neighbors, they said that for the past few days they had some bad smells coming from this young man's apartment. They could not really tell what is happening and they broke in only to find out this young man is already gone. He's RIP. And they went to call the police. They invited them. They came and they started on with their investigation. We just, we, according to the um, story published on Punch newspaper, they said that the police found hammer, hammer, hammer and cage and food. This hammer they use for carpentry work, okay? They found one hammer and the hammer was stained with blood. You get I don't want to make sure it's because of Facebook restriction. So the hammer was actually stained with um, obala everywhere, all over the body, stained with blood. And they were like, ah, what happened? How can someone be tied to a chair? and he's gone like his body is even rotten he's smelling only for them to find a note in one one of the share and the note wrote that according to what they write on the note they said that the people that bite this young man said that that yes they are the one that bite him because he bite their sister because he killed their sister and now Everybody are now confused because Ushena is gone. He cannot even explain anything to anybody. Though investigation is still going on, the people wrote on that paper that this young man used to um, kidnap women and children and use them to do money rituals. He used them to do money rituals to be doing yahoo clock so that he'll be making much money. I don't know how this story is even going, but that is what they actually published that this young man. That he has been killing girls and women just to just for him to be doing yahoo plus and all that and the people that bite him say that he bite their sister and people are now asking who is his sister and even to know the exact people that bite him they do not know it, the situation is just like they used higher killers to bite this young man you get they use higher killers to take his life because they did not get the people they they, they don't have any proof of the exact person that bite him so it is the, the person that even killed him is unknown to the people okay and they are alleging that this young man has been doing same to other people so in this life eh not be everybody they forgive so try as much as possible to keep your hands clean don't hurt people because you feel like you can hurt them don't hurt people because you feel like you are bigger than them okay this young man is gone and the people that killed him is are alleging that he killed their sister so what do we have to believe what do we have to take and this man is not here to even judge for himself so sometimes some people will only revenge people believe in karma once you do it to them they must do it to you if they don't do it to you god must bring someone who will do it to you you get so keep your hands as clean as possible so that what you don't know will not kill you that is all about this video. If you are coming to my page for the first time, please subscribe to my YouTube channel at KC Vlogs and follow my Facebook page at KC Vlogs or KC Don't forget to like and share. My name is Casey and you're here on KC Vlogs. Bye.